Hello friends, today you will see what all of Everybody Loves Raymond TV series stars look like now versus when they were on the show. You will know their real names and age. I will show you how they looked then in 1996 and what's with them now in 2023. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go. Number 1. Brad Garrett as Robert Barron Bitter, envious, and cynical, the only way to describe him. Robert Barron never endlessly complains about how his life has turned out. Robert, unlike his brother Ray, is more aware of his surroundings since his sense of humor requires him to continually make snarky comments intended to irritate Ray. Despite his jealousness, Robert also has a softer side. He is a romantic at heart and deeply loves his wife, Amy. He is also a supportive and caring uncle to Ray's children and a relatable friend to those in need. Robert Barron, played by Brad Garrett when he was 36 years old, and now he is 63 years old. Number 2. Ray Romano as Ray Barron As well as acting somewhat infantile, Ray Barron also has a weak, timid, and often neurotic personality and becomes hesitant to assume any responsibilities and he lives in abject fear of his mother, Marie. One of the things that stands out to Ray is his laid-back and easygoing nature. However, despite his easygoing nature, Ray is also prone to insecurity and self-doubt. Ray is also a loving and devoted husband and father, deeply committed to his family, and always tries to do what's best for them, even if it means going against his own desires. Ray Barron played by Ray Romano when he was 39 years old, and now he is 65 years old. Number 3. Doris Roberts as Marie Barron Marie Barron was what most people call a self-appointed matriarch, since she's completely under the impression that because she's the oldest woman of the family and the grandma, she has full authority. What she says goes, and it's either her way or no way. Marie doesn't even know how intrusive and manipulative she is, and if she did, it probably wouldn't stop her. The concept of over-nurturing is foreign to her. She sees the decline of the nuclear family as the sign of the end of times. Marie Barron, played by Doris Roberts, when she was 71 years old. Unfortunately, Roberts died in her sleep on April 17, 2016, at her home in Los Angeles, following a stroke at the age of 90. Number 4. Peter Boyle as Frank Barron Throughout the series, Frank Barron is uncompromising, stubborn, overly masculine, and shiftless. Frank will go over his Korean War stories no matter how many times his family's heard them. He's definitely funny, but his wit is typically biting. Insult humor is his stock in trade. He knows which buttons to press and loves to press them, especially with Marie. Frank is the definite lovable, grumpy old man. Well, more grumpy than lovable, but he's unquestionably old. Frank Barron played by Peter Boyle when he was 61 years old. Sadly, on December 12, 2006, Boyle died at the age of 71 at New York Presbyterian Hospital in New York City after suffering from heart disease. Number 5. Madeline Sweeten as Ali Barone Ali Barone is the complete opposite of the rest of her family since she is a go-getter who can overcome whatever obstacles she faces. She has the same stubbornness as the Barones, but, unlike the others, she doesn't allow it to stop her from striving for greater things. Ali is bold, but sometimes that boldness leads her into not knowing when to concede defeat. Allie Barron, played by Madeline Sweeten, when she was 5 years old, and now she is 31 years old. Number 6. Sawyer Sweeten, as Jeffrey Barron. Like his brother Michael, Jeffrey can, has the ambition to act inappropriately whenever he can. Jeffrey, unlike his sister Abby, isn't much of a perfectionist and would rather live his life as he sees fit rather than worrying about whether or not he performs things perfectly. When the occasion demands it, he is shown for his outgoing and honest nature. Jeffrey Barron, played by Sawyer Sweeten, when he was one year old. 
Sadly, on April 23, 2015, Sweden died due to a self-inflicted gunshot wound to the head almost three weeks before his 20th birthday. Number 7. Sullivan Sweden as Michael Barone Michael Barone is the entertainer in the family. Like his uncle Robert, Michael has a quick wit and isn't afraid to use it even in the most inopportune of occasions. He is shown to be a rather funny kid along with his brother Jeffrey as both of them are not afraid to get up in front of a crowd and their classmates to perform a stand-up comedy routine. Michael Barron, played by Sullivan Sweeten when he was one year old, and now he is 27 years old. Number 8, Monica Horan as Amy McDougall. Amy McDougall, like her husband Robert, can be a bit insecure when it comes to the people she's closest to or wants to be closest to. She finds it difficult to mediate disputes between the McDougall and Barron families because the ensuing conflict has a bad impact on Amy and Robert's union. But in the end, she lacks the maturity to handle the circumstance maturely. Amy McDougall played by Monica Horan when she was 34 years old, and now she is 60 years old. Number 9. Andy Kindler as Andy Andy is well recognized as a friendly and affable man who is often at the center of social gatherings. He is also portrayed as being somewhat naive and gullible and is often the butt of jokes and pranks played by the other characters on the show. Despite this, he is a loyal and supportive friend to Ray and the rest of the Baron family. And he's always willing to lend a helping hand when needed. Andy played by Andy Kindler when he was 30 years old, and now he is 66 years old. Number 10. John Manfrelotti as Gianni. Pat McDougall is the very definition of what one should expect from an overly shy individual. She consistently lacks the people skills needed to be properly included in her new extended family after her daughter marries Robert. When she makes a promise, she keeps it and will go out of her way to help others in need, though at times this can appear to be a little too needy. Gianni, played by John Manfrelotti, when he was 50 years old, and now he is 70 years old. Number 11, Patricia Heaton as Deborah Barron. As the wife of Ray Baron and, and the mother of their three children, Deborah Baron is the central character throughout the series. She is the only daughter in a household full of men and often finds herself in the role of peacemaker and mediator. Despite her traditional gender roles, Deborah is a modern and successful woman, balancing her career as a homemaker with the demands of raising a family. She loves her family dearly and cares deeply about Ray despite his immaturity. She's very romantic and wants it with Ray, but he is not as romantic as her. Deborah Barome, played by Patricia Heaton, when she was 38 years old, and now she is 65 years old. We miss Everybody Loves Raymond TV series cast so much. Who's your favorite character from the series? What's this thing that they have that's so appealing to you? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like and share the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you. See you on the next video.